Okay, so this is a model of some structures within your abdomen. Um, so we'll start from here. This is the pancreas and different parts of the pancreas. This is the tail, this is the body, this is the head, and this right here, the white part, the big fat white part is the pancreatic duct. And we'll go to the liver. This is a chopped piece of liver here. Over it is this gallbladder. And you can see little ducts coming off of it. Coming off of the liver, you'll have the right and left hepatic ducts. And then they join together to form the common hepatic duct. And the duct coming from the gallbladder is the cystic duct. That duct and the common hepatic duct joined together to form the common bile duct, which you'll see goes here, behind the pancreas, goes through the pancreas, and then you'll see the end of it here, going into the duodenum of the small intestine. And it, within here, you'll find an ampulla, and the part you see protruding up here is the papilla. Same thing occurs with the pancreatic duct. Ampulla within here, papilla here, and then, Sorry, we'll go back to the liver for a second. I was talking about the bile ducts before, so these little green things represent individual hepatic ducts. Green, green. Okay, so, yeah. Within the small intestine, you'll have these ridges called plica. It's probably later, but this is the, these are the kidneys. These are the super renal glands above the renal. This is the spleen, and back here from the kidneys, you'll find the right and left ureter. Yes, that is all, I think. Ureter. Okay. Ureter. Benito.